Hello YouTube, this is Asatsu5 and today I'm doing a quick review or under two minute review. These reviews are not for entertainment purposes, but to get the review out as quickly and as precisely as possible. Only mentioning the things I like or dislike about it. You get size references from my hand and my head. I don't go over stats or specifications, just purely the knife as it functions. This is the Case Sidebuster. Stainless steel, true sharp steel. This one has been customized to have an Anzo pattern. And this has a relatively broad blade that you can pinch open. And it's a single bladed knife. Mostly with my traditional American knives, I like multiple blades on the knife. But um, this is what I would call a uh, force knife or training knife. Uh, it's a good knife for um, kids to start off with. Slip joint knife. And things I like about it is simple. It's rugged. And this is pretty much um, the... All you need to break down a whitetail deer. You can use this one blade and break down a whitetail deer depending on the uh, processing uh, process that you use. You can use this blade to pry open the ball joint or if you want to just take the meat off the bone you can actually do it with this knife. You don't need anything bigger. Uh, you can actually use a smaller knife if you want to. Uh, Native Americans use flint uh, but um, this is basically if you if you want to give a kid a knife, a, a Boy Scout type knife, um, this will get the job done for 99% of the tasks that he might use it for. There's not a whole lot um, negative I can say about it other than the steel is pretty mediocre. Uh, nothing to write home about, but definitely a good using knife that you don't have to worry about um, damaging or making look ugly. It just works. That's it. I'm a Satsu 5 and I'm out.